probably not executed as well as I should have. But, you know, things happen. Every dog has his day. And I'll get back on the drawing board and come back next year. Do you feel overall, though, this is a great year for you? I'm sorry? Overall, great year for you. Yeah, overall, I'm very pleased with my year. I never thought in a million years that I would be a sophomore coming at the Olympic trial. So I think it's definitely a great year. And I still got some more stepping songs to go. I'm young. I'm, I'm really just a baby, so I got a lot of growing to do, and I go to the drawing boards and get, and get the job done. What can an experience like this do for you going forward? Just build confidence, you know. It, it let me know that I, I could belong out there. When the, like Definitely when my time comes, uh, I'll be on top of my game, you know, coming in there and not thinking that I was going to be able to make it to the finals, and it ended up in the final. He was amazing, so definitely has my confidence up, and I'm ready to gear up for the next season. The English should probably beat the relay team, is that correct? Um, hopefully, if I do, I'll be glad if I do. That was one of my goals anyway. I just wanted to get to London. It's been goals since I was seven. So, just chasing my dream, and hopefully, I get there. Maybe out of the country. Um, those are that because I'm so young. I gotta mature a little bit. They sound of shit take me up here and there. I had one in the first heat, and then now in the finals, it happened again. So I just gotta learn how to block it out and stay focused. A little distracting being in the field with those kind of athletes. Um. Not really. Like I was, I was telling my dad, we're practicing on the same practice field, we're warming up in the same tents, we're checking in to the same people. So I feel like I belong here, and so I got out there and I ran as the best of my ability. You feel a lot of support from the crowd. Definitely. I love I love Oregon Hayward Field fans. You know that they're, they're amazing. They're my support system. They're the reason why I keep going, and I can continue running for them and running good. What do you take from this experience? Um, just you know, I got to keep growing. That I, I'm I'm able to you know get on this field and. and, and run with these pro athletes and that I'm just going to do whatever I got to do to get the job done next year and four years coming. How was your footing? You got a too good start but it didn't seem like you accelerated like the world. Didn't push like I should have. Like I said, I didn't execute well in this race. Got a lot of things to work on. I'm pretty sure my coach is going to chew me out as I all said and done. And I'm just excited that, you know, this season is starting to wind down and I get a little breast and a little break and gear up for the next one. Overall, this entire experience was a lot. Shocking. I shocked myself, not the world yet. So we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Finally, you know, like I said, the line was laid out. It got to eat in front of, you know, millions of fans. So I'm excited and I'm glad that I was able to have this experience and I can't wait until I get another shot. What do you learn from that? Just keep going, you know. Got to be a student of the game. So I know what I did wrong. I go back to the drawing board and I fix it. Any thoughts on Ashton? He's an amazing athlete, you know, he definitely is one of those athletes where you look up and you actually say, you know what, I can do I can do it, he did it, you know, came in one thing and left out a world record holder, so, you know, he's they can't shun him at all, he's a great athlete and I'm very proud of him. Lauren made the final high Great, you know, that's my roommate, and so we just moved into each other and I remember waking her up this morning telling her to get dressed, so I'm excited that she made the final and I can't wait to watch her perform. What did you tell yourself after this event today? Preparation for this? That I belong here. I doubted it for so long that I was able to compete with the top runners because I'm only a sophomore in college. You know, I'm only I just turned 20. Didn't think that I'd be able to compete with all of these older runners, more mature. They have different workouts, better workouts than me. You know, they just all they do is eat, breathe, sleep, track, and I have school life you know i have all these things that i have to juggle so it just let me know that i belong here and that next time this round comes that i'm gonna be ready did you ever get a chance to talk to any of the other runners definitely you know they, they all told me you know good job you know because i'm the, the young and in the group and starting to come around and so everybody has their left and right eye on me making sure that, you know i'm okay so it's, it's great experience and i love every single last one of the competitors that i raced against today it's the best advice you got keep working hard have no limits and go ducks <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.